Hi, my name is Stephanie. When my brother and I were little, our neighbor's cat had kittens. After lots of begging, our mom let us keep one kitten each. I chose a girl kitten who I named Mittens. My brother chose a boy kitten named Rhino. I always wondered why Mittens has an orange, black, and white coat, while her brother only has a black and white coat. It turns out that genetics can be used to explain these differences in coat color. In cats, one of several genes controlling coat color is linked to the X chromosome. This gene has two variations, known as alleles, black and orange. Let's use a capital R to represent the orange allele and a lowercase r to represent the black allele. For females, there are three possible genotypes. Big R, big R would lead to an orange coat. Little r, little r would lead to a black coat. And big R, little r would lead to a mixture of both black and orange. However, for males, there are only two possible genotypes. Big R, Y would lead to an orange coat. Little r, Y would lead to a black coat. But why is it that females only can be a mixture? Well, this is explained by the Lyon hypothesis. In females, one of the two X chromosomes will eventually turn into a bar body, which is an X chromosome that has been deactivated. The number of bar bodies that is present can be calculated by one less than the number of X chromosomes. So a female with two X chromosomes will have one bar body. In a cell, the bar body is condensed and is pushed to the back of the nucleus. Let's think back to Mittens and Rhino and see if we can do a Punnett square to figure out their genotype. We unfortunately do not know anything about the dad, but that's okay. We do know that the mom had a black coat, which means that she is homozygous little r for this trait. We also know Mittens and Rhino's phenotypes. Since Mittens must get one allele from mom and one allele from dad, and she has both black and orange, her genotype must be heterozygous, and the dad must have the orange allele. Now, thinking about Rhino's phenotype, we can see that he gets one X chromosome from his mom and then a Y chromosome from his dad, which would mean his genotype has to be little r y. A quick note about the white spots present on both Mittens and Rhino is due to a different gene that is that also contributes to coat color that is located on an autosomal chromosome. Now let's look at what this looks like in development. The Lyon hypothesis states that inactivation of an X chromosome occurs randomly in somatic cells at some point in development, and once inactivated, all progeny cells have the same X chromosome inactivated. So let's say mittens consisted of four cells at the point of inactivation. Each cell randomly decides which X chromosome to inactivate. In this example, the first and the fourth cell deactivated the chromosome with the black allele, and the middle two cells deactivated the chromosome with the orange allele. As each cell begins to multiply and divide, they will develop and express whichever allele has been activated, which will eventually form the patches of orange and black in our coat.